Well, I mean, there's so much drama in sports. I mean, it, it, it's, it's, I've always been a fan. It's one of the reasons that sports have meant so much, um, you know, th really throughout human history, is not only are people testing themselves in remarkable ways, and not only do you sort of get to be in awe of what, you know, what human beings are actually capable of, it's stunning, you know, mm -hmm. but it also just sets the stage for these, these real life, dramas that play out in a short period of time with a tremendous intensity and, and everybody's playing for keeps. That's amazing. Well, I, I want to hear about this new movie, Rush. In our story, you know, which is really about the rivalry between uh, Nicky Lauda and James Hunt in that 76th season. Right. And Lauda was in many ways the first of the sort of the, the specialist, the sort of super professional you know, and it was just all business to him. Right. Every point was not you know, what just James was, did. Not <laughs> quite what James. These two iconic champions uh, really brought out the best in each other. Um, but it was pretty. You know, it had its intense moments. Sure. Yeah. Well, rivals usually do. Yeah. When you were you were a young guy and in your first championship season, would you have characterized? A rivalry with Aaron Hart. Hart. I don't. I looked up to him so much. You know, mm -hmm. I, I, I. Everybody wanted to accomplish what he had accomplished. You know, he knew how to to get in your head, and he mm -hmm. he knew how to push your buttons, whether it be on the track or off the track. Wonder Boy is here. I, I hear him talking about me. Talk like a little girl. <laughs> what? I'm sorry, man. I'm just not as big as you. <laughs> not as big a man as you. As intimidating as he was, and that was his nickname, the Intimidator, <laughs> I was able at times to intimidate him, not from pushing him around or, or, or saying anything to him, just from passing him, yeah. you know, and, and winning. And it is Jeff Gordon, victorious. It didn't matter whether he and I were rivals, our fans became rivals. Yes, yeah. yeah. Gordon! Gordon! Three. If you're an Earnhardt fan, you could not pull for Gordon. If you're right, a Gordon right. fan, you could not pull uh -huh. for Earnhardt. When his passing happened, it's amazing how many of his fans said, listen, I never pulled for you before. You know, we miss Dale, and I know you do, and I know you respected him. And for the first time, I'm able to be an Earnhardt fan, but pull for you. That sounds like a pretty important sequence in a movie someday. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, hopefully, uh, you know, we can create some more great moments that might be captured one day. Yeah. What was interesting to me, and I don't know if this was now, when we were at Indy, mm -hmm. and I was drinking it all in, I was fresh off just filming Rush, you know, right. so I was really, you know, kind of fascinated by motorsports and looking for differences between F1 and NASCAR, which there weren't all that many, to be honest. And, and, and what about the driving style? Because in, we de depict in our movie that Hunt was more instinctual and, right. and, and, and Nicky more ta of a tactician. I think every race car driver, they immediately try to relate to, to somebody that, that is another race car mm -hmm. driver mm -hmm. and their style. All right, you know, how, how much of James do I have in me and how much of Nicky do I have in me? I think earlier in my career, I was a little bit more of instinctful to just dive in there, right. just see what happens. As years have gone by, less of that. I feel like I'm a thinking driver where, where I think about the moves that I make. And so there's times I'm going to be a little more cautious because I think in the long run it's going to pay off, similar to Nikki. You know, James Hunt was a little more of a freewheeling guy. Right, right. In fact, but he was known to occasionally get in some altercations and take a couple of swings at people. So I'm here and I'm feeling a little combo, <laughs> Nikki Lauda, James Hunt here in my uh, no, uh, understanding well, of you and your recent history. I can't say I've taken many swings at guys, but I've caused a few, uh, <laughs> some controversy uh, for sure throughout my career. So this is uh, this something is, you guys use regularly? This is one of our screening rooms. And in fact, I have a little bit of a, of a kind of a Pavlovian reaction every time I come in here because I'm always being judged in here. It's always where you have your test screenings. It's where you, you show the movie to the studio executives, your, your peers, you know, the stars of the movie. It always happens in this, in all, this and room. It comes up there and you're sitting there being so, judged. So my stomach's time. getting tighter uh, even <laughs> well, as we speak. Well, you know, you, listen, I, I, you don't have to worry about me. You already have me sold. <laughs> well. Well, I hope you like what you see. I can't wait to see it.
showdown between you and Nikki is all anyone wants to see. First applause on the movie. No, I, I hope it's first of many. I think it will be. That's amazing. I mean, it, yeah, I, I love that you call it Rush because it, it definitely pulls you in and, and gets your heart racing.